you played as such a helpful character, such a uh, motherly. Like you still are, but it's like more of a like a very kind, ready to help, ready to be there in 2018 version of the game. To now, where you're like, I'm gonna kill him. You play a very different kind of different character, but now you have a completely kind of different, vengeful. You're ready to strike Kratos, kill him, all that stuff. Like, how is that playing that character? To more into the negative side in a little bit. How is that like uh, when you got into this going back to Freya? It felt really gratifying, to be honest with you. I, 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 f I felt a real duty and responsibility to Freya. I think she's a really important figure, female figure in, in the whole pantheon of video games yeah. in general. Um, that, you know, she leads with um, strength, vulnerability, courage, truth, being a mother. Um, you know, I talk about that a lot, like they didn't uh, overtly sexualize her, mm -hmm. uh, where they do a lot with, you know, and, and, and sexuality is a beautiful thing as a woman. I mean, after all, she's the goddess of love, sex for, and fertility and beauty. So yeah, she's got, <laughs> that's okay. Yeah. But when we're hanging our hat just on those attributes, you're sort of missing out on all the other aspects of, of who she is as a, as a goddess. And then the way that Sony Santa Monica Studios, the writers humanized her to just be this like this woman. So yeah, so the mother aspect was really great. And yeah, you don't you don't F with a mama bear. You really don't. Because <laughs> don't. as you saw, Atreus's when he gets angry, what happens to him? Well, that's internally what's happening with Freya. Smoky! <laughs> One piece of hope she had in 2018 in that game and in God of War 4 was to make amends with her son, to own what she did. She tries to explain, like, I, I, I can make us whole. We can start something new. But, you know, Baldur's like, he's done. Yeah. Um, and so, so much so that as a parent, I would lay down my life for him. And that's really a beautiful like analogy, right? That if the only thing that's going to make you whole, if that's the thing I took away from you, and as your parent, my one responsibility was to set you off into the world to succeed, to have a fully fleshed life, then you can take my life. But if that alone will make you whole, if seeing me dead will make things right, I won't stop you. Yeah. And of course... We all, you know, have feelings like, oh, they saved her and that's the right thing to do. But she was like, oh, my God, like you yeah. took the choice away. and You also took my son. So 